Don't ever change for anybody. Don't ever trade your soul. Don't even listen to him. I'm back again with another delicious recipe. So today I'll be making some Jamaican style curry chicken. So I'm gonna start off by washing my chicken with some vinegar. So I'm gonna pour some vinegar over my chicken. Now I'm gonna add some water and I'm gonna rinse my chicken off. Now I'm gonna start off by seasoning my chicken. I have four and a half pounds of chicken and I am gonna start off by adding some all-purpose seasoning. I am using one tablespoon of the all-purpose seasoning. Now I am gonna add one tablespoon of the Maggie chicken seasoning. I am adding one teaspoon of garlic powder. Now I am gonna add one teaspoon of the all-purpose adobo seasoning. Now I am gonna add one tablespoon of the Grace Jamaican seasoning. If you have green seasoning, you could add that. Some people add green seasoning, but I love to use the Jamaican jerk seasoning. And now, are you ready for the secret for the best taste in curry? Jam roll! Here you have it, the Better Pack Curry Powder. This is the best curry if you want good taste in curry. Now, I'm going to add like about two tablespoons of this um, Better Pack Curry Powder. And if you don't have this one, you could always use the small one, but I prefer to use the, I prefer to use this pack. Now I'm gonna rub my seasoning onto my chicken. Now I had all my seasoning, I rub my seasoning onto my chicken. I am gonna add about half of a small onion. I am gonna add some green bell pepper some red bell pepper i am gonna add some thyme and i'm also gonna add some we call it escalion but it's the same thing as green onion now i am gonna rub all these ingredients onto my chicken or into my chicken whichever you could put your chicken in the fridge to marinate overnight or in my case, I am going to cook my chicken right away. So let's start cooking. So I have my pot preheated with some oil. And I am going to go in and add one tablespoon of curry. We usually say, oh, we're going to burn our curry. We're going to keep that um, the curry in for maybe about a minute or two. You don't really want your pot too hot and you don't want to burn your curry for it to be black. You just want to just give it a minute or two. I'm going to add a piece of ginger to that curry. So now... I am about to start adding my chicken to the pot. So when you add all your chicken to the pot, you just want to leave back some of your seasoning or your veggies that you cut. Now I am just going to go in and I'm going to kind of stir this a little I am gonna cover my pot without adding any water and I am just gonna leave this on medium heat for like probably like around five minutes so 
my chicken has been cooking for five minutes. After five minutes, I'm gonna turn um, turn my chicken over. So I cut a uh, Irish potato and I am gonna add about half a cup of water to the seasoning that I have here. And I am gonna add it to my pot. I am gonna add a scotch bonnet pepper to the pot as well. And I am gonna allow my chicken to cook for about 35 minutes, but I'm gonna go in occasionally and stir my stir the chicken and make sure that the water um, doesn't dry out completely. So after about 28 minutes of cooking my chicken, this is what it looks like. I didn't add any more water. It was just the half a cup of water that I added and the chicken basically made its own water.